Japan Dino, the best of Japan to you. Howdy, this is Angie of Japan Dino, and I have for you an HKS super sequential blow-off valve on the flange for the MR2, the very rare flange, very difficult to find flange for the MR2, the Toyota MR2, the universal super sequential blow-off valve made by the HKS company, good for any particular turbo vehicle, universal and adjustable type blow-off valve, but the, uh, the real charm point, the unique thing about this particular valve is it is on the flange for the MR2 and the MR2 flange has got to be the most difficult flange to find so and very very vehicle specific so the MR2 flange is super SQV and in a good 100% working condition uh, marked and stained and also scratched all over the valve as you can see in the photo here not a particularly tidy S super SQV but 100% working condition and we'll run through some further photos we have here, the photo of the vehicle it came from, a Type 5 Golgata uh, Heisei Juichinen. So a Heisei Juichinen Golgata, the fifth shape of the MR2. And, of course, the uh, 3S GTE engine, SW20 MR2. So this particular flange that the uh, valve is on will fit any of the SW20 turbo vehicles. Very, very specific flange. You can see the flange there and the little bracket on the side. The valve itself, of course, you can see mark there, a big uh, rub mark on the side, more rub marks there, staining on the back of the valve, but in 100% good working condition. But the flange being the, uh, the real sales point of the item, is it so vehicle specific? You can see it here in the, in the vehicle before it was removed. The very, very specific valve fits directly in where the stock valve is removed from into this little flange here, plugs directly in there. So it needs to be the very specific flange for the MR2. And back of the unit, we can see there, again, 100% working condition, but very marked and stained. And this also gives you a good view of the very specific flange for the SW20. If you wanted to modify the flange, of course, it will work with any turbo vehicle, as it is a universal blow-off valve made by the HKS company here in Japan. And front of the unit, of course, has the SQV, very, very specific SQV look. And the unit itself, of course, being a sequential blow-off valve, has a diaphragm, diaphragm pushed on by the boost pressure from below, pulled on by inner manifold vacuum. When that overcomes the resistance of the spring, the diaphragm moves in little fluttering sequential movements, hence the name sequential uh, blow-off valve. Little sequential movements pull a piston, which then releases the boost through the front of the valve. The piston moves back and forth, Close up a little piston here, allowing boost to squeeze around the edge of the uh, piston, creating that very distinctive HKS super sequential blow-off valve sound. So very attractive blow-off valve, of course, from the front there, very attractive blow-off valve. The HKS super sequential moved from an MR2 with that very specific MR2 flange made in Japan, from Japan. Thank you. In order to serve you better, we have our website at www.japandino.com as well as our blog, the Japan Dino Daily Fix, where we feature items of special interest. Look forward to seeing you there.